Well, the reports of Libya mobilizing its air force against its own people spread quickly around the world. But Russia's military chief says that they've been monitoring from space. And the pictures tell a different story. Well, Artie's Edina Galushka can tell us more on this now. Um, Edina, what are they saying? Well, Alice, at this point, we have information from Russia's joint staff who are saying that they have been monitoring the situation in Libya from space via satellites since the beginning of the unrest in the country. And according to them, some of the reports by the, made by the Western media are not entirely corresponding to the pictures that they are getting. Uh, to be more precise, according to Al Jazeera and to BBC, on the 22nd of February, uh, Libyan government has inflicted airstrikes on Benghazi, the biggest city in the country and on Tripoli. And according to Russia's military, they have not registered any of those air strikes. According to them, the pictures show that nothing of that sort has been going on the ground. Now, if we also focus on the pictures, uh, on the footage that we've been getting from the country, we may be able to notice that uh, there are absolutely no signs of any destruction inflicted by attacks from air or by Libyan Air Force in those pictures. So at this point, uh, Russia's military military is saying that uh, as far as they are concerned, uh, they have not seen any attacks. So they, they can pretty, ma pretty much make a judgment that those uh, attacks, which the Western media has been reporting on, have not been made. Also, uh, Russian military is also working in very close cooperation with Russia's uh, Ministry of Foreign Affairs. And they're monitoring not just the military situation, not just Tripoli and other uh, cities in Libya. They're also paying a very close attention to the oil extraction facilities and they are keeping us up to date as to what is happening on the ground from space. Okay, Irina, many thanks for the update. That was Artie Zirina Galushka there reporting from Moscow on the Russian reaction to the Libyan conflict.